SOA exam P practice question number 16. A medical insurance company issues a one-year policy with a deductible of $500. The probability is 0 0.75 that the insured individual has no medical claims and the probability is zero that the individual has more than one claim. If there is a claim, the medical expenses before application of the deductible follows an exponential distribution with mean $5,000. Calculate the 90th percentile of the insurance company payout on this policy. Let's take a look at the solution. The probability is 0 0.75 that there's no claim. And from the question, the probability is 0 that the individual has more than one claim. This implies the probability is 0 0.25 that the individual has exactly one claim we need to get the 90th percentile. The 90th percentile of the payout on this policy falls under the event that there is exactly one claim. So let's focus on this 25%, the event that there is exactly one claim. The 90th percentile of the payout on this policy is equivalent to finding the 60th percentile of the payout given that there is a claim. Here we focus on the last 25%. And if we consider that there is exactly one claim, we need to consider the first 15% reaching from the 75th percentile to the 90th percentile. So 0 0.15 over 0 0.25, we get 0 0.6. So this is the 60th percentile of the payout, given that there is a claim. Let x be the expenses given that there is a claim. The expenses follows an exponential distribution with mean 5,000. So we have the PDF of x, 1 over 5,000, e to the power minus x over 5,000. And we get the CDF of x, which is one minus e to the power minus x over 5,000. To get the 60th percentile, we set the CDF equals 0 0.6. Solving for the value at the 60th percentile, we get $4,581.45. This is the expenses before the application of the deductible of $500. So subtract this 500 from the value we calculated. We get the answer, $4,081.45. And this is the 90th percentile of the insurance company payout on this policy.